Okay, so this looks like a regular Pythagoras uh, theorem question. So what we have is a right angled triangle. We've got uh, two lengths already given to us. We've got the five centimeters, we've got 13 centimeters, we've got a missing side. Now the only difference here is that in the previous videos, the previous examples that I've looked at, what we've been doing is trying to find the length of the hypotenuse. So trying to find that length. This time we're not trying to find that length, we're actually looking at the length of one of the other sides. But it's still going to be using Pythagoras' theorem, so we write that down first, a squared plus b squared equals c squared, and we label the triangle accordingly. We label the c first, remember, so c is the label for the hypotenuse, and the a and the b are the other two sides. So we've got a, which is now x, so x squared. We've got b squared, so that's 5 squared. And we've got 13 as c, so that's 13 squared. So 5 squared is 25, and 13 squared is 169. Now, if something plus 25 is 169, then the something must be equal to 169 take away 25, so 144. So you can see that there is a subtraction here rather than the addition that was there before. So 144 plus 25 is 169, so that's why x squared is 144. We then need to square root as we usually would. So the square root of 144 is 12. So that would mean that x is 12 centimetres in length. And that's how we can use Pythagoras to find the length of a missing side.